Ok, gracias. Eh, cheers. De nada. Oh, oh. YouTube? ¿Tienes YouTube? ¿Sí? Ok. Taking up the rear, snake dust. Good morning everybody, welcome back to the logbook. My name is Jeff, people call me happy to be here. <laughs> and uh, that is going to make sense <laughs> mostly for the people who have seen the previous episode in which I got myself into a lot of trouble. If you wanna see what that's all about and the context for today, you wanna to go see that. Um, so today I'm in uh, Laredo for a couple of days uh, to sort out the uh, tire bike set up and then also uh, get a few things done laundry being one of them so uh, yeah that's the that's the plan for today and lots of phone calls and me butchering Spanish later uh, uh, there are no tubes in town there's no ordering tubes that'll be here in a few days and there's no um, ways of you know using something else and uh, so, yeah, I'm probably gonna rent a car and then uh, drive to La Paz tomorrow and buy a tube and then bring it back with me and then change it up so I'll probably have to stay another day. So, you know, as far as places to be stuck, not the worst. Okay, laundry done. Next, tacos. All right, it's morning. Last night at Taco Place, the bartender told me that th there's gotta be a place around that sells tubes. And so he called a couple places and there was one that was a bike shop, but apparently they sell moto stuff as well. So that's where I'm going now to catch, see if I can get there early and hopefully they have, uh, they have what I need. Well, I was fortunate enough to be in Laredo for the party of San Javier, which is at the beginning of December, where there's a pilgrimage, mostly of horses or horseback riders or other people that really like beer and tequila, to go up to San Javier and party up a storm for like three days. So that was Talia Manny and they had one motorcycle tube and that's the exact one i need <sighs> so good so no uh no road <laughs> renting a rental car and driving to the pass four hours there four hours back so we should get this to be able to fix today uh, i may have to stay another day because i need to book a room for my motocicleta uh, which i could also stay in the room that comes with the parking spot so that's good so uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Rodolfo is the mechanic in town who I was told is the best. And uh, he, I talked to him yesterday, he was great, but he was gonna order me a tube, but uh, that was gonna take weeks. So I've got one, but now it's today. And I think it has to do with the uh, horse party up in uh, San Javier. But uh, yeah, I can't get a hold of him. So I uh, might have to do this myself again. Please hit the road, but we have to do first uh, the map. Okay, I'm mapping it up here. Here we go. So, started in San Juanico the other day, and then we cruised down there a little bit, and then we took a high road that really was terrible, and that's where we met Keith, and then we went over to San Isidro, and then from there, I think we followed this one. Yeah, to come on do. And then from there, that's where it got weird. Uh, on this one, we basically, uh, yeah, the wheels came off, quite literally. 
and then uh, came this way and down to Laredo. That's where we are now. So the problem is, uh, I don't want to risk my bike. The next place to get my bike looked at, my wheel, is here at La Paz. So we're just gonna go down this to La Paz. All right, now, um, we are checking out of the hotel, or we've already checked out of the hotel, and we are rolling. This is, whoa, <laughs> that's not a good start of the day. That's a terrible start of the day. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so we need to go. I wanted to uh, just ride this tire a little bit before I fully pump it up. It's uh, just over 20 PSI right now. And I'm going to pump it up a little bit more, but I want to get up to a gas station that has an uh, air pump. So this is the historical zone of uh, San Javier. I don't know if I'm allowed to ride my motorcycle through here, but I saw a car. Unless it's a police car, I think I'm okay. So, yeah. Oh, no, I don't think I'm allowed to, but I'm going to get it hell out of here. <laughs> anyway, so that used to be the sand, the nice part of town, but I just ruined it. Now we are going to uh, get out of town. <laughs> that was funny. No right hand turn, that's where I went. It's really nice in Laredo. It's a kind of a good balance um, of amenities, and still there's a lot of good, you know, Mexican flavor. But it is definitely a tourist area. But it's more Mexicano than a lot of tourist areas that are for the gringos. It'd be really nice to get ships up in the air, but because of a crazy wind, that is going to be unlikely. But hopefully you can see this majestic scene in between piles of dirt. So you can see the, um, these little bays have they're they're all over on the Sea of Cortez side they're really beautiful especially all along uh, from Santa Rosalita down to Loreto they're beautiful and they're they're just speckled everywhere and um, yeah you can kind of see it the are uh, yeah you, there's usually a little restaurant down there some palapas, you can camp at them. It's pretty, pretty cool. Just pulling over to check out my tire. Before I get, oh no, no, Jesus. Man, okay, so I've got, I got a flat again. It's uh. It does pump up a little bit. So I'm gonna take the wheel off again and see if I can uh, patch, if it's a patchable thing. I didn't really have faith in this anyway. I, I don't know, it just didn't feel right. Um, two wasn't, yeah, anyway. So, uh, <laughs> here we go again. This time, I'm doing it right. Start the music. <laughs> I don't know if you can see this, but right here, there's that little slit. So that's patchable for sure. I'm just gonna go over the rest of the tube with a system that um, Sistat showed me, because uh, he's a mechanic, as well as a cook and a beverage maker and all that stuff. So uh, yeah, we'll try that method. I'll show you in a second. So circle this, and then if you, uh, 
You see, you can, I don't know if you can see that. This is the same juice that I use for uh, my windshield. So you can use that. So I'm just gonna squirt all over the place and see if I can find anything um, that will be uh, another puncture or something to that effect. Here's my patch kit, which I always bring. It's, um, you know, I mean, if I could have patched that tube in the middle of nowhere, I would have done that for sure, but it was such a violent tear that there was no fixing it. So, I mean, this one, eh, should be, should be okay. These bad boys. While this uh, glue is drawing, I'm going to check out this tire to see if there's anything that looks like shit. I'm just going to make sure I can get all this dirt out. <laughs> Look at you! <laughs> oh, <was> so funny. <laughs> So there's a thing when you're putting a tube back on, uh, there's a tube buddy that Motion Pro makes, and there's also a trail buddy, which is this. And this goes in right here, and then you tighten it up, and it sort of uh, just place, sets the tube tire well so you can go around and uh, put everything in place. So, not bad. Uh, I mean, it only took, well, with editing, it took what, like a minute and a half? easy so yeah if you ever get a puncture it only takes a minute and a half as long as you're okay at editing <laughs> that was a weird one obviously a uh, human error defective customer Let's see if we can make it more than 30 kilometers this time <laughs> so right up here, actually this guardrail, oh, painful memories, <laughs> so that guardrail, uh, I hit that thing, going quick enough, um, I was going obviously way too quick for the corner because it tightens up at the end, but this road we're entering to is the canyon and it is really fun and curvy but uh, watch your speed because this cement is a cheese grater and if someone wants to see it I can show you the video of me in the hospital in Laredo <laughs> I got a hole in my elbow arm and uh, yeah it's pretty funny anyway uh, yeah, so we got this one up for a little bit, then we get up top onto a plateau, and then it's Ciudad de Constitución, where we're going to get some food. But enjoy these corners, slowly, very slowly. Let's take a look and see what we got for food. So this is how I do it. I just Google. Usually cities have a... Hola, como estas? Is it bien? It's a moto? Donde la moto? <laughs> Can you do jump? See? Let go, let me see. Okay. I can't do it. <laughs> See, sticker? See? Sí. Sí. It's the me canal on YouTube. Sí. And the moto total uh, Vancouver, Canada, uh, Panama. Uh, yes. Thank you. Okay, gracias. Hey, you. Thank you. De nada. Oh, oh. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> it's not me, a canal on YouTube. YouTube? TNS YouTube? See? Okay. Perfecto. Oh, shit. Okay. 
Buenos dias. Shamelessly plugging away to kids all over town. <laughs> I give it away stuff. Okay, so uh, how I usually do this is I just, you know, look at restaurants. Uh, Google is fantastic for this. Super Tacos Arandas. <laughs> okay. Super Tacos. Can't not get Super Tacos. That's just silly. Super Tacos it is. Let's go. Oh man, I can't stop thinking about how good that food was. Absolutely fantastic. I'm putting on a jacket. It is getting cold. I'm uh, just about an hour away from La Paz. Should be able to uh, <coughs> make it before dark. But uh, you know, it's uh, it's it could, it could be close. <laughs> and we'll get a hotel and all that jazz. Anyway, back on the road. Yeah, that that restaurant was so good. It really um, reminded me that when you go and look at just something that looks absolutely like something you wouldn't do at home do it try it out and man i was so uh i was so happy with that food uh carne asada taquitos they were so good anyway that's my uh that's my thing let's get let's get moving <laughs> If you can see this. Bug. I haven't seen a bug in a while. I want to get off this bike. <laughs> it's been a long day. It's been a real long day. Yes. I made it. So happy. Uh, that tire I think had maybe half an hour left in it. It was like looking pretty pretty soft when I just got off the bike now and uh, so you know anyway this is the uh, place I got uh, bedroom uh, what a weird one <laughs> really weird eh? so that's that's a lot of tire changes in in one episode <laughs> well I guess it spans too I don't know I haven't edited it yet so you tell me <laughs> Anyway, if you uh, like this video, give me a little mini thumbs up or a big thumbs up or a high five. It's all in there in the like button. And if you want to see what happens, well, see if I ever get out of La Paz, <laughs> then, uh, you know, press the subscribe button or smash it as the kids are saying these days. <laughs> and, uh, you know, you'll get to see uh, this trip and how it uh, unfolds. And uh, as we've just more recently learned, you can't count on anything to go according to plan. Alright, go out there, find someone, and make them laugh. <laughs> and taking up the rear, snake dust, on the old Triumph. Ha, ha, ha.